Meet Todd Negative. He's been tasked as a drifter. He's the son of Pete Negative, who was also tasked as the original drifter. Now it's up to Todd to build his world up around him. Can he do it? Hey guys, this is your friend Les. Welcome to the Drifter Challenge House 2. Yes, here we go. I hope you guys are as excited as I am because I am very freaking stoked. So we have <laughs> Todd here. Go ahead and press play. He is our new drifter and uh, it is his job for House 2. I'm not going to go over all of the rules here, uh, but it is his job to get that house that house has to be worth how much is it forty thousand this time around the first time around it was thirty thousand and then he's got to marry a working sim either you know the mail lady uh the pizza delivery lady uh gardener somebody to produce the air so it has to be a working sim so we got to keep our eyes out for a working sim and then also he's got to complete the outdoor enthusiast aspiration but his kid his heir has to reach uh the child life stage uh, before he can even start working on that. So the rules are pretty much the same, just different, um, just different things that we have to do. Um, so I have his outdoor enthusiast uh, aspiration already checked, and woo, looks like he's already got some satisfaction points from House One because all of that carried over his skills. Let's see, charisma, comedy. Cooking is a, is a level two. That's awesome. Fitness one. Logic one. Uh, mischief three. Uh, video gaming two. Writing one. How did he get a writing level one? I have no idea. But that's that's a very, very good thing. Who's this over here? That's uh, the mailman. Oh, man. Our mailman is a guy. That's uh, not very cool. All right. So we can't travel anywhere outside of this lot here this area this is where we can only go but guess what we got this special tree here whatever the heck it's called i can't remember and that means we can yes folks we can travel to sylvan glades and we're going to do that first thing you know why because he can work on his fishing and start catching some sturgeons and man oh man those sturgeons are like worth tons of money tons of money and of course his money has started at zero for house two you have to start at zero so yeah fun times fun times so i'm gonna have him view this a couple of times uh hopefully we will run into some working sims that are females preferably young adults we don't want any old folks let's go ahead and water that tree not that there's anything wrong with old folks, but the female old folks just can't produce babies for us, so we, we, we have to go for the young ones. Alright, so let's water that bad boy again. Here's some kids walking by. He, Mark, Mark Bowling, dude, you look sad. What's wrong there, buddy? Did you have a bad day at school? Alright. So come on, Todd. Let's see Give us some new options. Let's water that bad boy again. Let's look at his symology. Let's see. 20 days till the age is up. Let's check out. Let's see. How's his parents doing? Uh, dad's still alive. Mom's still alive. His dad was Peter Negative. And his uh, mom is Christina, otherwise known as the Danish Simmer. And his twin brother, Jared. Um, hopefully, we'll get to see those guys eventually. And looks like I got lucky compared to Vaisha. Her, <laughs> her sim um, had really bad stats, so she wasn't able to get anything accomplished like the first day or two. So I, I lucked out here. All right, let's see here. Okay, Wes. Come on, Todd. Hurry up! Hurry up! Don't play on your phone. Let's discuss some more nature. Let's open this bad boy up and get to Sylvan Glades. All right. Let's see. Does that help his his social? I, I have no idea. Look at the pretty butterfly. All right. It's open. Let's explore it. And let's hope that I don't fail. I have to admit, doing this on camera makes me pretty nervous. I usually get there every single time but sometimes I, I i do mess up and i forget hello ladies how's it going nice to see you 
Too bad she's a teen. All right, tree adventure. The trunk is a lot bigger than anticipated. It's dark, but somehow not scary. A faint glow is the only light. A rolling burble, the only sound. Let's follow the sound. And let's see, as we wait, we'll hum some Jeopardy. Do, 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 do. Oh, here we go. All right, tree adventure. Todd delves a bit deeper and a bit darker. A soft splash tells him that he has just stepped into a shallow stream. Let's follow downstream. Crap, should I had chosen upstream? I, I don't know. We'll find out soon. Hopefully I don't mess this up. Come on, Todd. All right. Taking the path of least resistance and hoping that it doesn't terminate at a sewer main. Todd is distracted by an ethereal mist glowing ominously. Ominously. I can't talk today. Let's enter that mist. Come on, Todd. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Oh man, the pizza delivery guy is a dude. That's that's not cool. We need some female ones. All right, tree adventure. The mist is warm and friendly. As far as mists go, without warning, Todd feels the sensation of being spun around. An exit to the cave now staring him in the face. Woohoo! We did it. Let's travel to the glade. Yes, I want to send Todd to the Sylvan Glades. Let's go. Let's go. All right, so. Now we get to wait for this loading screen. Luckily, it's not too, too long. Uh, so, yeah. Hopefully, we're going to make some awesome money. Here we are in the beautiful Sylvan Glades. And, oh, darn it, he's already starting to get tired. But you know what? We got some satisfaction points we can spend. And, yes, we're going to... We're going to spend those bad boys, because I want to spend a lot of time here. So we're going to go ahead and get the Moodlet Solver for 500. That only leaves them with 420 satisfaction points, but that's okay. Drink that, dude. Get off your damn phone and drink it. Oops, sorry, I just said a bad word. Sorry, kiddos. All right, so let's have him do some fishing. Oh, look, he's got some books in his inventory homework. We'll go ahead and sell that. At least it's worth a dollar. Here's his grade school homework. That's worth another dollar. Uh, so we will take that. All right, he just acquired the fishing skill. Come on, Todd. Come on, buddy. Let's let's catch some good fish. Let's kick some catch some good stuff, so we can make that money and hopefully you know we can we can buy a toilet, a sink, a refrigerator, put up some walls all in the same episode. Wouldn't that be awesome? I think it would. I don't know about you guys. Come on, dude. Let's catch something good. Let's go ahead and fast forward a little bit just to make the time go oh. faster so we're not wasting time. <laughs> Alright, what do you... Oh, he didn't catch anything. That... That really stinks. Let's see. Sounds like the sound is off <laughs> from from what we're seeing. Uh, sometimes that happens when you go into ultra mode. Ultra speed. Ultra mode. Ultra speed. Yeah, ultra speed. That's what it is. All right, Ooh. come on, let's fast forward. Let's see. Come on, buddy, catch something good. Catch something good. Oh, you... oh no, that's not cool. Not cool. He's he's not doing good at all. Let's see. Let go ahead and clear all that out. We're gonna fast forward. That's for... oh d gosh, darn it! This guy, he just he has he just can't do anything. Let's see. He's a he's a creative. He's a geek. He's a music lover and he's a muser. Too bad he didn't get that special trait for outdoor enthusiasts Ooh. that you get the collect the collection trait, whatever it is. I, I don't know. Darn it, why didn't I pick that originally for him? I don't know, but that's okay. We do what we got to do. Alright, so we're just... Oh, what did he catch? What did he catch? He finally caught something. Here comes level 2 of that fishing skill. There it is. And he just caught an emotion potion. Yeah. We're not going to drink that thing. We're just going to sell it. Uh, zero simoleons. That's, that's messed up. Should be worth a lot more than that. All right. So we're just going to keep fast forwarding here. Come on, Todd. Catch us something good. What did he catch? He caught, he caught a minnow worth five bucks. Nice. We're just going to keep going here. Come on, dude. 
Come on, come on. Catch us something good. What did he get? What did he get? Did he get a cowberry plant? I don't know. I don't know. What is it? Oh, it's another emotion potion. That really stinks. Alright, so we're just going to go ahead and we're going to sell that bad boy. Alright, so we're going to fast forward again. Come on, Todd. Come on. Come on, buddy. Get us something good. Oh, he lost it. That is not cool. Not cool at all. Uh, so we, oh, what did he get? What did he get? What did he get? He got a koi worth 15 bucks. Right on, right on, right on. We're just going to go ahead and we're going to sell that and get our 15 bucks. So now we're up to 17 simoleons. That's good. Uh, how's his stats looking? All right, let's keep fast forwarding here. I'll have him stop in just a second. I want him to reach that level 3. And then we'll go around and, and collect all these collectibles that I see, and maybe we can harvest some stuff too. Alright, we can. We can use all that stuff as bait. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm still coughing a little bit, still kind of sick. I'm starting to get my voice back, which is good. Um, I'll be glad when I am back to normal. Alright, he reached level 3. What did he catch? What did he catch? Ooh, look how excited he is. Oh, look at that guy. Did you see that? Alright, he caught a pomegranate. Nice. I don't think we're going to sell that. I think we might plant it. And let's see. I'm just going to fast forward again. Let's see if he catches anything else good. Ooh, look at that. Our dear Todd just caught a salmon worth 105 simoleons. We will take that and we will sell it. Yeah. Alright, now we're up to 122 simoleons. And now he's feeling inspired because he had that good catch. Um, at least I think. Feeling inspired? Nope, it's just from his creative trait, that's all. Poor guy's not going to be able to get creative anytime soon, that's, uh, for sure. Alright, so we're just gonna... Maybe he'll catch a sturgeon next. What did he catch? What did he get this time? Oh, he cut that cow plant berry! Woohoo! Alright. Let's fast forward one more time. And then this is going to be the last time, I swear, I swear... While he does that, let's look at these beautiful surroundings. Doesn't it look awesome here in Sylvan Glades? It's so beautiful. And look at those clouds. Those, those clouds are kind of creepy, though. Yeah. This is a pretty cool place. Alright, back into regular camera mode. Let's see, did he catch anything new? Nope. Come on, dude. Come on. What did he get? Oh, he got another minnow. We'll use that for bait. All right. Last time, I swear, I know I said last time that that was going to be the last time, and yeah. I lied. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. All right. He caught a beta worth eight simoleons. All right. As promised, we're going to stop for right now. Oh, yes. With the fishing, at least. Let's have him... Harvest those snapdragons. Let's look for some frogs. Come on, Todd. Hurry up, dude. We are on a schedule. Let's see. Is there anything over here that he can collect? I don't know. Are those the snapdragons? I had them. All right. He just acquired the gardening skill. That's good. Oh, the strawberries aren't ready. That's okay. Let's see. Here's more snapdragons. We'll harvest those. Wild bluebell point. Plants that well, they're not ready yet. That kind of stinks. Lily flower is ready to go. All right, he found a dirt surfer frog. Uh, how much is that one worth? A hundred bucks. Woot woot. That is freaking awesome. All right, let's see what else we have to grab. The mushrooms aren't ready yet. All right, he's feeling confident from that catch he had. All right, let's see here. Just gonna pause it for just a second. Sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, we'll come over here. We'll grab this frog. Look for frogs. And what's this? Uh, cherry tree. Oh, darn, it's not ready yet. That stinks, but that's okay. It is what it is. And what do we have? Lily. More lilies. Lilies are pretty flowers. Let's see. Bluebell. Not ready. None of the bluebells are ready yet. Uh, let's see here. What do we have? More snapdragons. We will harvest those. And let's see here. Another frog. Oh, he found an eggplant frog. That's cool. Is that another cherry tree? Nope, that's a pear tree, which isn't quite ready yet. And what do we have here? Bluebell. 
Bluebells aren't ready. What's over here hiding? More lilies. And did I miss anything? Snapdragon. Basil. Basil's not ready. Oh, look. A froggy. I think I missed that froggy. Alright. Bluebell. Not ready. Okay. I think that's about all that I'm going to harvest for right now. We're going to come back over here. I know he's starting to get hungry. Um, so... I don't have anything that he can eat yet. Eggplant, striped dirt frog. Let's see, those... Those aren't quite... The ones I was hoping for. Alright, let's uh, let's go ahead and fish with that minnow. Let's see what else we can catch. Uh, he's starting to get hungry. His energy starting to get low. His bladder is starting to get low. Um... So we need to do something about money. All right, so he got the super eggplant frog. Dirt surfer, striped dirt. Hmm, hmm. Let's breed that dirt surfer with... Hmm. Let's do this rare one. Oh, uh, no, it gave me another one of those. It, that's not the outcome that I wanted to, wanted to have. So I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to sell that bad boy. Next time I will breed it with something different. Alright, come on, Todd. Catch us something good, dude. Catch us something good. And let's see here. He only got three lilies. That's that's it? Well, that's not cool. Well, we're not, gonna, we're not going to uh, sell those. I think we're going to plant them. I think you can garden a little bit to make some money. I don't know what you guys think. Alright. So he's not catching anything as of yet. Let's fast forward. Fast forward. Come on, catch something good, dude. Catch something good. I don't know if he's going to catch something good or not. We'll, we'll see. Because I got to... Ah, man. He looks like the fish are too... Let's try one more time. Let's fish with some bait. Let's uh, fish with another minnow. Hopefully he will do good this time. I... Probably. You know, I thought he got some basil. Didn't I have him harvest some basil? Where did the basil go? I guess he didn't get the basil. Not sure what happened there. Maybe I didn't click on the basil. A new fish has been caught. What did he get? He got a salmon worth 78 bucks. That's all that thing needs to be sold. Uh-oh. Todd's got to go to the bathroom. So let's, let's have him catch one more fish, and then we're going to send him home. All right, he reached level four. That's good. That's good. Come on. Come on, Todd. Catch one good one. What did he catch? He got a minnow. Lame, 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 lame. <clears throat> Excuse me, so sorry for coughing. Come on, catch something good, catch something good. Don't lose it, don't lose it, don't lose it, don't lose it. Oh, what did he get, what did he get, what did he get, what did he get? Ah, uh, he caught an uh, emotion potion. Darn it! That's not what we wanted. Alright, let's stop that, let's send him home. Tide needs to go home. I know, I'm gonna get you home, I'm gonna... Try to buy you a toilet, dude, so you can, like, go to the bathroom. If not, I'll buy you a potion. I think we have enough for a potion, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. So, the fishing trip wasn't quite as successful as I wanted it to be. Excuse me as I take a sip of my water here. Um, but we'll go back again. Um, but first... We're going to work on his needs, and before I have him do that, I'm just going to have him dig that up. I'm probably going to pay for this. Let's see. Let's look for frogs. And let's go ahead and we'll dig that up. Huh, usually there's some more right there, but I, I guess not. Nope. Dude is starting to feel uncomfortable. All right, he found one quartz. Let's go ahead and, and sell that bad boy. It's worth... 30 bucks. 
And let's see if he gets one more frog. If he gets a good one, let's see what happens. Oh, he's going to have to go pee soon. He's going to be doing the pee pee dance. Striped eggplant frog. Dirt surfer. You know what? Let's breed this eggplant frog with the new one that we just got. Ah, gosh darn it. All right, we're just going to sell over those. And we're going to sell those. Let's go ahead and send him home. And let's see here. That's the $30 one. That's a $100 one. I'm going to keep the $100 one, and we're going to sell that $31. one. All right, let's go to build mode. Let's get this dude a <laughs> toilet before before he messes himself. We don't want that to happen. Let's see. Plumbing, plumbing, plumbing. Toilet. All right. I'd much rather would, you know, get him a... Uh, an expensive toilet, but that'll have to do. All right, let's go have him use that. Let's see, does he make it? Does he make it? Where's he at? Come on, Todd. Come on, buddy. Oh, come on. You can make it. You can make it. You can make it. You can make it. There he goes. There he goes. Don't piss your. Don't pee yourself. Sorry. Bad mouth. Um. Yeah, I don't know what happened today. Bad mouth. Bad mouth. Chuncha. I know, you're getting tired, you're getting hungry, I'm going to take care of that dude. I'm going to take care of that. And we're, after he does that, he's going to grab that collectible, he's going to look for frog's deer. And let's see, what do we have growing here? We have a bluebell plant, which he can only view at the moment. And what else is there? Here's another collectible. Or how Manda Sim says, she says diggables. I, I like that. <laughs> Great, and we're going to look for frogs there. Hurry up, dude! Hurry up! Alright, so he found a piece of limestone, which is cool. We're just going to kind of follow him along. We'll fast forward just a little bit. Alright, he found a sun surfer frog. That's that's a good sign. 125 bucks. Um, too bad we can't breed a frog yet. Let's see, how much is that worth? 50 bucks. I think we're just going to sell it as is instead of extracting it because I'll probably get one that's not worth anything, knowing my luck. So I'd much rather take the 50 bucks. All right, normal bluebell plant. Potato plant. None of these are ready to be harvested yet. That really sucks. All right. So we're going to sell... Oh, nope. I'm going to hold on to that treasure map. All right. He found a sunflower frog. All right. So let's check his inventory real quick. Sunflower frog, uncommon, worth 30 bucks. We're just going to go ahead and sell that. Ooh, excuse me. And let's go to his aspirations. And we're going to get him the... Uh, not the instant hygiene. Let's see, where's the food? Where's the food? Where's the food? Let's see. Potions, instant fun, instant hygiene, confident, energized, flirty, focused, happy, inspired. I I don't see it. All right. And that means we probably cannot afford it. So I'm just going to let him go to go take a nap. And looks like we are out of time here. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to end this episode right here. I'm going to let him go to sleep. But don't you guys go anywhere. Stay where you are because we have another episode coming up right after this. Drifter Challenge House 2 is finally here on my channel. And I'm so, so freaking excited and i hope you guys are too thanks for watching guys and i'll see you right after this bye thanks for watching guys make sure you like the video if you liked it and don't forget to leave some comments because comments are awesome i love interacting with you guys and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already have a great day y'all bye